Hey, good morning. So today is day five of booktube -a and I woke up early. It's um, around, what is it, 8.30 or... It's 9.01. I filmed the video for today because I thought it was a very interesting topic to include in booktube -a So I have already that film. I'm going to edit it later when I come back because I have a dentist appointment today. So I'm going to that. I'm going to take my book because I'm going to read over there. I'm not going to take my camera because I don't feel comfortable taking it out in public especially speaking in English in public because this is a Spanish-speaking community and when you start speaking in English a lot of people start looking at you especially if you're gonna flip out a camera I'm gonna have more people looking at me so I don't want to be the weird one you know in a crowd of people but um, I'm going to do a couple of errands and then I'll be updating you later on throughout the day so I will talk to you later on okay so a little bit of an update is, is currently 7.23, I just got back from everything that I had to do. I had a crappy day today. Really crappy day. How was your day? Better than mine, I hope. First of all, I started with a crappy cell phone reception. Like, I don't know what the hell happened to my internet or my phone. And it was horrible. Like, really, really horrible. Then we had to be in the social administration office. We were there for like four hours. Four hours. For them to tell us that they're going to send it to us via email. Or not email um through your mail and i'm like why couldn't you tell us that why wait make us wait for like four hours then i went to the dentist appointment and i know one thing i hate the dentist appointment my teeth right now hurt i wanted to finish a monster cause during my dentist appointment but unfortunately i was getting a little bit sentimental because there's a part where like right now it starts to get a little bit more deep and um i didn't want to cry in the doctor's office so i'm going to finish it in a few minutes um, I'm really, really am enjoying the story, like I said. Um, I do know that Connor, he is lashing out because he doesn't want to accept the reality of what's going to happen. You know, the inevitable is about to happen. And I know I'm going to cry in the last couple of pages. So I'm going to read that, finish it, and then I'm going to update you in a few to see what the heck am I going to do. Because when I finish A Monster Cause, I'm going to complete the three books of this challenge. So I'm going to pick up another one and I'll be telling you later on. So I'm going to enter my dogs because they're outside right now if you don't hear him. Snow is crying. He's literally crying because he wants to come inside. He just went out for like five minutes. Gotta get him in. So I will update you in a few. Kizzy Baja. Kizzy Baja, Mikey. Hi, Mikey. Kizzy Baja, Nene Jorone. Huh? Okay, they're thirsty. That can sell. Do that can sell, huh, baby? Dile hi. I mean it. Okay, so it's 9.56. I already uploaded today's video challenge. I was just editing it. I'm going to up um, edit the vlogs that I need to edit because I have to edit both days. I was supposed to upload it yesterday, but I didn't. So I'm gonna do that. My teeth still hurt also. I'm like, oh, my teeth hurt. But I finished A Monster Cause. Oh man, this, I was not expecting to love this book as much as I love it right now. It's just five out of five stars really. Um, mostly because of the connection that I felt to it, the sympathy, the empathy. Oh my God, this is a sad, heart-wrenching book. And the ending just, oh, it made me cry. I had watery eyes. I was feeling a lot of, pain a lot of hurt especially for connor i mean he's such a strong individual and i i just i love him to death he's just such a sweetie and everything that he had to go through this is a very interesting story and i highly suggest for everybody to read it because it's just that good i was not expecting to love it as much as i did and the only thing that i regret is not having read it sooner but what i'm going to do right now is that i'm going to discover what other book i want to read because today is friday we still have Saturday, Sunday, and so I really want to discover like what book I'm going to read. So I'm going to tell you that in a few minutes, but I don't think I'm going to read it today. I'm going to read it tomorrow because I want to edit this vlog and I want to upload it. And I think I'm going to reward myself with watching the final three episodes of Angel of season two. Because I've already read three books in this book Tubathon, which is something that I was not expecting. I'm kind of glad that I participated in this booktubeathon because it got me out of my reading slump and also out of my video slump. So, you know, 
yay for me you know I'm doing good but I'm going to discover what book I'm going to read next and uh, I'll be updating you in a few but I'm not gonna read today like I said I'll read tomorrow okay so I already decided what book I'm going to add I'm going to add Rebel of the Sands this is a book that I really really want to read so I was like you know what since I'm in the kick of reading let me just get this out of the way so this is the book that I'm gonna start I'm gonna start it tomorrow not today like I said I'm going to watch Angel and it is 10 10 I am going to finish editing this video or this vlog and I'm going to upload it and I will talk to you tomorrow so have a good night hey good afternoon it's 3:23 right now and today I've been a horrible vlogger I really haven't been in the mood to vlog lately or at least today I've been cleaning my room so that I was cleaning my room this morning when I woke up I had an early start to the day it wasn't that I woke up like around one o'clock in the afternoon no I woke up like around seven but I started cleaning my room because I have two dogs constantly in my room so I have to clean it and then I was cooking with my mother because we were making sancocho and the sancocho really did like liven up my spirit because I was feeling like a little bit down and sancocho at least like soul food is always good for you you know it'll get you in a good mood so we did that and then obviously I ate I was taking a couple of pictures because of something that I had to do for my bookstagram and I, I just took a shower and I've been sitting here doing nothing. I've been looking around trying to do something because it's like I want to read but I don't want to read. But I am going to start reading. I'm going to start Rebel of the Sands because I read like two pages yesterday. But that's obviously not reading anything. But I'm going to read for like three or four hours because I just want to read right now. Right now I'm in the mood to read. And remember last night when I said that I was going to watch Angel? I didn't watch Angel at all. I, like, my teeth were really hurting. So I just decided to take a pill and just lay down. And that's what I did. But what I'm going to do today is that I'm going to read for at least like four, maybe five hours. Maybe around there. I don't know. And then I'm going to stop reading because I really do want to watch some TV. I haven't watched any TV. And I've already read the three books for the book two with on that I wanted to read. But I just want to add another one in. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to read. And I will update you later throughout the night apparently okay, so i really wanted to film today's challenge but i'm not going to film it because i'm looking through my bookshelves xiomara is with an x there's no x in any of my books there are z's well, not a z oh there's a y there are plenty of v's there's a w but there are no x's I don't have a library. Oh, The Matrix had an X. How did I not know that I had that book? Oh. I just saw it right now. Oh, that's so funny. Anyway, I'm still not going to film it. I, I, I don't have any patience to film today. At least not a video challenge. I don't know. I just want to read. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get back to reading. I'm reading outside. But I didn't want to film this outside because the exposure is too light. So that means I have to turn it down. But then I have to turn it back up when I'm in here. So I'm really lazy today. Have you noticed that? I'm very lazy today. So I'm going to get back to reading. So it's 10.20 right now. And I just hit page 146 in this book. And I'm really enjoying this book so far. The world building is very distinctive and very unique. And I am enjoying you know the magical attributes to it so that's something that's really positive right now um the story is going really fast so it is a really fast paced story and the writing is very it's okay it's a very good writing you know something that'll get you you know to fly through it i am enjoying the main characters i'm starting to notice that i really do like characters that have a smart mouth but i am enjoying their interaction and i like both of them a lot so we're gonna see how well it turns out I'm going to continue reading it tomorrow. I'm going to stop right now because I don't want to read anymore. Probably going to scroll through Instagram for a while. I might watch the last three episodes of Angel. I don't know. I've been saying I'm going to watch them for a couple of days. But hopefully, probably I'll watch it today. But that's it. I'm going to end the video right now. And I will be updating you tomorrow with my reading. So I will see you tomorrow. Have a good night. And peace. Hey, so it's 4.14 and I just noticed that I accidentally deleted this morning's footage. 
because I was supposed to delete um, the unboxing that I did and I accidentally deleted what I had spoken to you about in the morning <clears throat> so that's perfect right but anyways I haven't been doing much um, today the only thing I did this morning was to film that video that I had to film then I um, was editing it and I still have a couple more things to do to edit it I just want to sit here and read for a little bit I did read a couple of minutes ago but I want to read a little bit more because today is the final day of the booktubeathon and oh, it's just so sad. I mean, it was good, but it's it's sad at the same time. But I'm also glad that it's ending just because I think I overworked myself with all this filming. But, you know, at least I got back into the swing of things and also back into the swing of reading because I did feel like if I was in a little bit of a reading slump. But um, I'm okay with that. I completed the three books that I wanted for this um, readathon and I added a fourth. So I'm very proud of myself, you know? So I'm going to read a little bit more. Final update of the night, it is 10.22 and I already finished Rebel of the Sands. I have to admit that I really did enjoy this book. It is very fast paced and the world building is very good. And I really loved the main characters and also the side characters that were introduced in the end. And I can't wait to see what else happens in this book or in this trilogy. So I really want to pick up the next installment. The only thing is that I don't know if I want to give it 4 or 4.5 stars just because the main character, Amani, is one that I really connected with, but after like one third of reading the book, I didn't connect to her really fast, you know, and I love the fact that she's a sharpshooter. What I didn't like the fact was that she mentions a lot more that she is a smart mouth than actually being a smart mouth. You know, sometimes characters will say, oh, you know, I have a smart mouth. It'll be like once or twice, and they actually show more that they are a smart mouth than actually saying it throughout the entire book. So that's one thing that I had an issue with, but Jin, I loved him. Since the beginning, I loved him so much. He really does have a smart mouth, and I really did love, you know, their banter at times. I didn't like sometimes that Amani would smack him, like, I was like, why are you smacking him, woman? Like, what? what's the need for that? But I'm really excited. This is the fourth book that I finished in this um, readathon. I wasn't expecting to read four books, honestly. I was actually expecting to read two and not even finish the last one. So I'm really content that I actually managed to finish the three that I wanted and also finish a fourth one. So I basically accomplished all of the reading challenges except the final one, which was read seven books. So I'm really content and I really had a lot of fun. Unfortunately, I didn't get a chance to do today's challenge just because I... Honestly, I didn't feel like doing anything today, but I really did enjoy, you know, reading all the books that I did because I have to admit that all the books that I read were very entertaining and were very good and I'm very proud of that, you know, because lately I have been reading books that haven't been that good, so I think that's also a reason why I fell into like a little bit of a reading slump, but it picked up with all these books that I, you know, managed to get out of my TBR, so that's going to show me that I'm going to be picking up more books from my TBR because they are very good. I'm also going to pick up the second installment in this book because I, I need to see what else happens. But that's it for my video. I want to thank you for watching all my vlogs and good night. Until next time. Peace.